not an exit. CCTV. Let's see. Here you going, everyone. Let's venture into the world of closed circuit television once more. Here we have a pizza man giving the okay. doorbell a ding dong. He has a telepathic connection with his oh, pizza car shit. and realizes it's not... in danger. Will he get there in time to save it? Will the pizza also remain edible? Yeah, no, nah, yeah, he's nailed it. He looks good on camera, which is bloody rare because most of the time the purpose of CCTV seems to be to capture people making an absolute oh, dick of themselves. That hurts. You believe that when you put your camera up, you're going to see baddies doing baddie stuff. But in my experience, nah, not the case. Sean here just gets footage of himself face planting the whiskey shelf in the bottle. Dude, he's lucky. I think he didn't fall and over. And he also gets footage of staff standing around, looking at him, wondering if they get to go home because of his concussion. I guess I'm asking if CCTV is a worthwhile investment. This person has ended up with oh, footage shit. of a car accident on their camera, which could be helpful to solve a court case in future. But do you really need to see one of the drivers naked and running around for 10 minutes after the accident and entering your house still naked? Do you need that in your life? Bro, what? And finally being apprehended out the front of your house again naked. Is that what you bought security cameras for? Is it? A bunch of you cheeky bastards <laughs> what the are probably fuck is going yes, on? that's exactly why we buy them, Aussie man. And we also like to oh. know when a horse and carriage is running around our neighbourhood. Fair enough. I'll raise your horse and carriage in America with a kangaroo, oh, kangaroo chased by a dog down under. I'd argue most of us install cameras so we can see shit like this. <laughs> he loves it. He absolutely <laughs> loves it. The dog is like, yeah, I'll see what else is out here. The barbecue is rogue. It's going rogue. Oh. Wow. Me. He manages to stop it. Now the Ute oh, is going no. rogue. No, he, he doesn't see this car. Pizza delivery car at the oh, beginning. shit. And we're back to seeing ourselves look like idiots. Drunkenness, oh, it, CCTV is huge for seeing what we look like shit-faced. Aim for the door. You got this via right. Oh, no, no, that's left. That's a pot plant, not an exit. Oi, Alana, don't exit through the pot plant, says her sober friend. You always do this. <laughs> Good mates will Bad force door, you through a door when you're legless. But Alana just can't do it. She really wants to pick a fight with the pot plant. Now she wants to talk about work and relationships with her mate for a while. A manager steps out of the CCTV room to go help out. Take the shoe. Take the shoe, Christina, is how the video ends. I assume she's still stuck. <laughs> okay, here's one CCTV video of someone doing something good. Yeah. Oh, damn. He brings hope to us all. He can't believe it. He concludes that he must be Spider-Man. That's a fair enough <laughs> conclusion. Overall, CCTV oh, videos great. are very suspenseful. You get a thrill out of not knowing where it's going and what's going to happen. Will I see injury? Will someone fucking die? Will I see a hero? Will not much happen at all? I think oh. not much is happening in this one, unfortunately. <laughs> what the way? <laughs> that car was zooming. What the fuck? Freaking crap on me zooming, dude. When animals fight back. Hey, you going, everyone? Welcome back to Wafab 11. I'm going to open on a cranky hippo because why not? You only live once. Oh, my Get God, away dude. From my hippos are vicious. Water, yells the hippo. The humans do take that request seriously and bugger off. Cut to a raccoon attacking a child. Yo, that raccoons. Sick trash Yo, what behavior. the fuck is raccoons That's doing? That's stereotyped this creature. Here's the perpetually protective mother. That's stereotype number two. Oh She's my. like, Get away from her, you bitch. Full Sigourney. The child doesn't want to step foot on the ground anymore. Fair enough. It was like the floor is Dude, lava trained by the four raccoons. Now it's one on one. This is going to get what real she ugly. Oh. Mum yells, here you are. Oh, but the, the raccoon's fuck? like, nah, suck shit. Have you got a shotgun, Earl? I imagine she says because it's raccoon America. Wants to live. All right, you little dickhead. You've had your fun now. Hucky ducky. Oh, raccoon launch successful. <laughs> it takes a moment to recover and then creeps towards the house to probably find Find a way into the girl's bedroom. Don't try to look cool around galloping horses, especially if you don't know them. A horse that's a stranger can be very dodgy. No advertisement or whatever you're making is worth getting absolutely shit mixed. <laughs> by Why would she think it was going to happen? Big win for the horses. Oh, here we go. Everyone thinks they're the Little Mermaid. Everyone thinks they're in a Disney animation. Oh yeah. Oh, no. just fuck off out of here. Back to dry just land. Mumbles the sea turtle. This holiday. 
holiday maker realises her inflatable crocodile isn't real. It's not going to save her. She thought she had a bond with it, but it's just a bit of plastic. Here comes the ferocious sea turtle <laughs> once more. Is it going to bump her off? Oh, it has! Kind of, or she bumped herself <laughs> off. Now she's like the the turtle? Titanic trying to hop onto another wanker's flotation device. The turtle's going to rip her to shreds. Yes, no, no, no. She's safe. All good. As for the inflatable crocodile, hopefully that makes it out alive as well. Here's a goat cow hybrid. I don't know what it is, but I what? know it's Greg that? because this bloke's about to yell, God damn it, Greg. Really? Is this a Canadian cobra chicken? I think it is. And that is the final thing that human ever saw. She wanted to help a baby devil bird. Bad idea. Oh, this guy. Bam. Oh. I feel so bad for him. He's a simple man trying to run a farm. Bam. Down he goes again. Why it's do a they... toxic relationship. Oh. Bam. Say goodbye Bro, to those things are dicks. Ow. Here's a part those of the goats? world where they do not fear Godzilla. That lizard dinosaur is child's play compared to what we have here, which is a local elephant that thinks what? it's a fucking parking expector. That is worse than a fine. <laughs> Working with snakes. Oh, okay, hell no. I'm I would not, not work with snakes. people's career choices. I never thought I'd be an internet guy. I don't know what's more stressful, needing to upload new videos all the time or handling big fuck-off reptiles. She chucks it in. It sticks its tail out to mess with her. Oh, there's the attack. And a standoff. Fuck you. Get in there. Strong words by the homo sapien. She puts the pin code on the door lock and says, Why can't we be friends? Why can't we Why be can't friends? Why can't we be Oi, friends? Free shipping Feb is still happening on AussieManshop.com. You get free shipping on all orders on all products this month. All right. Let's see what else we got here. We boomeranging it. In Australia. Sure, man. G'day, everyone. Welcome to me, Critical Analysis oh, of it's Balloons. The, it's the it's balloons. a hot topic. Did you all see that Chinese spy balloon in America? Yeah. It's not a very stealth way to spy on yeah, someone, very, is it? Definitely not yeah, no, yeah, if we saw that in Australia, we'd definitely boomerang it. I wonder what gender it reveals. This lady is like, please don't boomerang or pop our balloons. Would you do that to Google? Bam! I hope military personnel <laughs> yelled, destination popped when they shot it down. There's Joe. He's like, like, usually I love a good balloon, I'm pro-balloon, but this one gave me the shits. I was worried it'd catch onto a house <laughs> and then it would be like that movie Up. Have you seen that movie Up? It was sad at the start. What were we talking about? Here's a reprobate <laughs> doing what Even I call a, vertical a littering, where they throw rubbish the into the stratosphere instead of onto the ground. They've got little letters attached which say, I'm a shit for brains litter bug. There they go, but hold on, the tree is about to fight back. <laughs> oh, the tree got all of them? Damn. <clears throat> I wonder how much they spent on all those balloons. Surely at least 30 bucks. That's what humans do these days, isn't it? <laughs> Watch out for the... Turn the camera back, please. Wait, Watch out for the rogue Christmas balloon. <laughs> bauble orca what? smasho. It's shed its Christmas skin like an exploding snake. Imagine trying to explain this when you get home from work. Yeah, I saw a giant oh Christmas my bauble explode, kind of. What the fuck? There's another one. <laughs> and it's a fast bauble. Aaron's who's going down. Their baubles? Am I saying bauble too much? But seriously, who's responsible for the roaming baubles? I reckon it's Bazza, the bauble guy, and he's got gonna get a stern talking to after this it's activity romantic yeah nope oh dear this dumb ass oh, hot air God. balloon is shaped like a penguin here's the thesis yeah, question the, my padawans the truck. is the penguin balloon gonna be better at flying than a real penguin what's your gut feeling use the force yeah nah nah yeah i reckon you know which way this is going <laughs> Hashtag fly penguin. Wow. And there it is. Oh. Not too bad, but pretty dodgy. Anyway, I'm going to end Yo. on an inflatable Doggo. bluey because why not? I love bluey. You love bluey. Everyone loves bluey. This is the only balloon I like. And condoms. They've saved me a couple of times. Anyway, everyone, <laughs> like and subscribe and go to aussiemanshop.com. For nice, man. Nice. Let's see here. Well, it's not bad. Is there any other ones real quick?
Healthy dose of road rage karma. I'm down hey, Owen. Welcome to Instant Karma. It's been four years Yo, since cat. the last episode, so it is time to revisit the theme. Don't do. Don't this mess with the cat. This human is like, should I bully the cat? I want to bully it. I'll jump on the trampoline. It will go no. flying. Everyone will laugh. The cat says, yeah, nah. And there you go. Stinky water mixed with cat piss all over his shirt and <laughs> jeans. This video absolutely gets my karma rometer <laughs> ticking. Oh, dear. This fella has an unhealthy dose of road rage. Something about a chair and a little wheel makes us turn into animals. There's a lot of threats of violence and murder. Now there's a foot chase. Oh. Look at the speed. He's like Dash from The Incredibles. He tries to do a fly kick and that is his downfall. Oh. Literally a fucking downfall. Have you heard the story of Steve O'Sullivan? Canadians probably have. He gets whacked in the face with a hockey stick. Ouchie ouch. Give the bloke a moment to recover. What's this? A dodgy wanker in the crowd. Heckles him. Ah, oh, shit. You never kick someone when they're down. Don't do it. Don't do it. Later in the game, the puck flies into the audience. There it is. This could hurt someone, and it has. It's hit the dickhead that was trash-talking Steve-O square in the brain. Of course, <laughs> the last thing a wanker like this needs is damage to their brain, it's going to make self-improvement <laughs> He goes up to him and says, hey, bro, yo, your oh, head. bloody Sullivan loves it. I do too. My karmarometer is on a 10 out of 10. Don't whack the cactus. Never whack a cactus. That's what you get. That's bloody what you get, yeah. Karma. I agree. Another karmic sport video. Some people are happy at the TV. Some are sad. This Tennessee man is angry and uh -oh. probably drunk. When you're angry and drunk, you need to realize shit doesn't end well. What was and the point of that? Today's lesson, kids. Whether sober or intoxicated, never attempt to cause harm to electrical equipment. Yeah, not don't electrical. Do that. Maybe. Fuck. Go punch a pillow. But anything electrical, glass, high up, living. Calm down. Walk away. Okay. Yep. We good. We've had a chat. Good. Good. Now this Let's guy move is on. dead. Overall, karma can catch up with you instantly, or if not, it will get you down the road. Here we have fans of the Real Madrid soccer team, I mean football team, who had given up on their team. They thought they were losers. So they left the stadium and now have to watch a great comeback outside the stadium on their phones. Oh, and this that's... is ultimately how karma works. You make yeah. a shitty ass choice in a split second with piss poor judgment, and you have to trudge on through life living with it until it breaks you physically, mentally, emotionally. Emotionally, you hit rock bottom, develop addictions, push everyone away until it's time to rebuild and learn from rebuild the karma. And learn. Embrace it. Give the karma a nice big hug. And yeah, nah, yeah, just fucking get on with it. Get on with it. Yeah, yeah, me again. So it is rare that you get to launch brand new products when you do oh. merchandise. Maybe it only happens a few times a year. That and it? that's why I'm oh. super. That is it. Of the road rage. All right. Solid Aussie mans. Nice Aussie man reviews.